Murray lad, hold tight. They're all inside. It's just people. It's just people. It's just people. Come here for an eyeful and an earful. They'll soon be gone in a minute. Ladies and gentlemen, the silence of the gallery is complete. You, you may or may not be aware, but on the 27th of February of this year, a Dr. Alan Matheson Tory and a Mr. Arnold Munn with a peer of Winslow Matheson Tory on committal proceedings on charges of gross indecency. Gross indecency? Gross indecency of all the things to be up in the dock for. Isn't indecency by definition gross, Mr. Judge? Is there such thing as nice indecency? Pure indecency? I suppose that's what we had. A couple of days of pure indecency. I'm not a queer. I'm down on me luck. He bought me a nice white fish on a nice white plate and that makes people act funny sometimes. I was seduced. What's his excuse? A month in here, locked up like an animal, dark and full of the sounds of other people's nightmares. It was funny. A few weeks ago, I was with the boys, Harry and that lot. Breathing into my hands, it was so cold. Where was my next meal coming from? Try getting a bed because you haven't got a roof over your head. Good luck with that. But get caught for buggery and you get three meals a day, somewhere to sleep, all at Her Majesty's pleasure. Her Majesty's got a funny idea of pleasure. A man's mouth isn't too different to a woman's. More stubble, but it eats, doesn't it? and curves downwards when he's sad. Maybe in another universe, there's a place where men and men, and women and women, and I don't know, people and people are not so hateful of each other, not so far apart. Alan appreciated me. I really think he did. My hair's receding, and I'm not yet 20. No girlfriend, no money got fired and now everyone in this room thinks I'm a sodomite too. A little appreciation is nice, even if it comes from some professor who's mad as a hatter, but gentle as a beret too. Come on lad, get a move on. Don't look away from me, Alan. I remember your lips were very soft. And it was lovely in the morning to watch you drink from one of your thin china cups. It was only a few times, a couple of times here and there. I can't believe I mentioned it to Harry. Stupid. He had to take advantage, break in, Take whatever he wanted, as usual. He's the thief. He's the one who broke in. But it's not him up here, is it? Can't see his grubby little face in the crowd. That's justice for you. That's Her Majesty's pleasure. They all look so afraid of me. All of England, everyone in this room, is against us. Yet they're the ones who are scared. All these lawyers and barristers and legal types. Leaning forward to get a better look, are you? Like we're monsters. Are you Alan Matheson Turi? I am. Are you Arnold Murray? Uh, yes, ma'am. I am, ma'am. At least I get a judge and a jury, I suppose. Plenty of others aren't that lucky. They get their heads bashed in. And the last thing they see of Earth is the long, grey Oxford Road. <laughs>